They start out as a block of stainless. Yeah, and then uh, they get whittled away, and most of the stainless ends up in the chip pan, which we recycle, and we end up with this shape right here. This is the Scarab. It's a descent control device, and it's made out of solid billet stainless steel right here in our, in our uh, machine shop at Conterra. And what it's designed to do is it's designed to lower heavy rescue loads. And by loads, I mean a stretcher with a uh, patient in it and uh, rescuers to control that, uh, that patient's movement over difficult terrain. Uh, but in order to do that, you have to be able to control the load to keep it from falling. And so that's what this is designed to do. So if we have an anchor and we attach the scarab to the anchor, uh, the scarab is uh, symmetrical, so it doesn't, we can't really put it on backwards. It can go any direction on here, but it's nice to have uh, the scarab set so that this crossbar opens up towards the sky. It makes it easier to use. And the way we operate it is we take a rope and we take a bite of rope. A bite is a 180 degree uh, turn in the rope, and we simply trap that bite with this crossbar. Then the ready position for the scarab is over a forward horn like this. We can lower a single body weight pretty easy like that, just by the friction of the rope running through that, uh, that hole and over the crossbar. Now if we have more load, like a multiple person load, we can add another horn and that provides more friction. We can add even a third horn for heavy rescue loads. And then if we want to stop, we can add another. And to stop for a long period, we can tie this off simply by making a captured bite and cleating it off just the same way you would cleat a boat at a dock. And this will hold until the rope breaks. But if we're going to leave this unattended, we can add a second bite to keep the first one from inadvertently being knocked off. And that's all you have to do to lock off the scarab. To start it up again, you just take these off and off you go. That's all there is to it.